In five games, the Royalton Royals are undefeated and have only given up 14 points. Our Taylor Archer went to practice today to find out how they stay driven. It's homecoming weekend for Royalton, and this team is locked in for Friday night. We watch film. We make sure we know the other team's plays, what their tendencies are, so we can come off the ball faster and win, win that play. Royalton is 5-0 and with three games left in the regular season, but their main goal is to not settle. Every week is a new week, and each opponent is different, and we game plan for everyone and go hard each week. So this year we implemented some what we call the process, and the, and the, the kids have really bought into that. So the process says that, that, that each week we have certain things that, that we have to do. Perfect examples, last week we, you know, we didn't do the greatest in third downs, so the kids on Monday morning wanted to see the, 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 the metrics and, and you know, all those nice sheet I put together, and right away they see red on third down, and what do they say? Coach, we got to work on third down. The Royals are excited for the challenge of taking on conference rival Uppsala Swanville. Big rivalry. We need as much support as we can get, and it's just that much more motivation to win. Came in and worked hard every single day, and just taking one game at a time. Win or lose this weekend, the Royals will not surrender their work ethic. We have two wingbacks on either side of, of, the, of the ball. They're not worried about their own stats. They're worried about getting the other guy the stats, which means they have to block well. They're really, really hard-working, blue-collar kids. In Royalton, Taylor Archer, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.